Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here one trailer at a time today. We're going to take a look at a 2019 Open Range 3X, model number 427. It's got three inch walls on it, Willie. Five slides, bunk house, double bathroom, awesome unit coming in here on trade at Lazy Acres. And I'm here with my friend, that international man of mystery, William Sir Candy, on the camera today. William? What's going on everyone? Welcome back to the number one RV tube channel in the world here. Like Josh said, three inch walls in this guy, so serious unit, um, something you don't see every day. And something they're coming back out with with open range for this year as well, so, mm -hmm. so look forward to that. Like and subscribe to the YouTube channel, Facebook, TikTok, and Instagram, and hope you guys enjoy this video. Right on, Will. Here at the front, we have a front fiberglass cap that you would think is just a brand new unit. Like that thing looks awesome here on the outside. Some cool looking eyebrow lights here we don't have on. I don't know what you were doing, Willie, when we were setting up. We have our standard 1621 pin box in through here, rougher style storage, and then you have battery and box location in on either side, so you can have it hooked up here and then have another one hooked up over there parallel. Six point electric auto leveling with the JT strong arms are built in. And then we're gonna have three 20 pumper paint tanks, our pass through storage is in here. I like this, Willie, because this door opens down because otherwise you have to open up like this and be kind of uncomfortable to get into. So this one opens down, the other one opens up. We have our auto level controls over there to your left. We got a nice little paper towel holder in through there. And then right here's your docking station, outside shower, city water connection, black water flush kit, times two, gate valves, winterizing, all that kind of stuff done in from there. 10 uh, gallon gas electric water heater, 50 amp detachable style cord, and this is where your sewer hose is gonna be stored. We have our living room slide right here, pulling our big like C-shaped or U-shaped couch off the floor. As we wrap around the back side here, we've got our uh, bed, like our rear slide, which is pulling our bunk room off the floor. There's a couple bumps here, Will. There's one right in through here. And as we head back down, we've just got a little bump right here too. Do you see that, Will? Now I do, yep. All right, hard to see unless you got an experienced RV salesman like myself pointing it out to you, eh, Willie? Yeah, no kidding. All right, we got our two more slides here on the door side. We have two awnings, which are a, a different style of hardware that I'm used to seeing. They're right up on the roof line there, so they're able to go right over top of both slides. Gives you great awning coverage here on the door side. We've got the other side of the pass-through. We have a TV out here, furnace vent. You can put that barbecue in the pass-through right in through here if you want four-step entrance up and in, lend a hand, grab handle. And then what do you think's in here, Will? Honestly, I have no idea, man. Oh, Back of the fridge. We got ourselves an ice maker. So to get to the ice maker for winterization, they gave you access right there. We've got a secondary door here into our bathroom. He knows we're filming. Yeah, I don't think he cares. <laughs> no, he doesn't care. Uh, we got our outside kitchen sink plumbed in. Our uh, two burner stove top is out, three burner stove top is out in through here. Three cubic foot electric fridge, nice little bit of storage here. Let's go have a look inside. Right on folks, we're inside that 427 open range. Great outside, really, really clean here on the inside. Very, very nice. We got ourselves a couple chairs in through here, which we don't usually get on like a bonho style trailer. We've got this massive U shape uh, dinette slash couch area. The center portion here is gonna pull out into a secondary bed. We've also got dual pane windows on this model too. So three inch walls, dual pane windows, great insulation value on this model. Cover space across the top of our C-shape and then across the top of our chairs as well. We've got some good covered space here. I like the hardware on this, Will. Yep, really, really nice. We've got a good looking island uh, that goes around the backside of the sink and through there, solid surface, of course. And then right here, we have our Frigidaire uh, residential fridge. Let me get that out of the way for you. Freezer on the left, fridge on the right, good looking fridge there. And then we also have our Frigidaire convection and microwave, Furion uh, oven and stovetop here, three burner stovetop with glass stovetop cover. And then this is gonna pull out for some you know, small little drawers there for spices. And then right here, we've got our farm style sink, 50-50 split on that. Cutler drawer, OG manuals. A little garbage can action, you bet. Garbage can action, tell your friends, pop down, 
two drawers here down the center, and then one more cupboard right in through there. And then looking back, our TV location is facing our big U-shaped couch, DVD player radio here, open storage, and then great pantry location in here underneath the TV. All right, bunk room, Will. Uh, hold on, one thing. You got a little electric fireplace oh, wow. on the back side of the island, just in case you're not willing to run the furnace and that kind of thing. Yeah, I forgot about that, Will. So thank you for pointing that out. Into the back bunk room here, two slides in this bunk room. So we've got a whole lot of floor space, storage, and sleeping bunk, couch slash bunk, wardrobe here for the kids' clothes or adults' clothes, cupboard space there, couple drawers here down below. Fantastic. And then here we've got another bunk, and then there's another bunk that's actually gonna fold down here, Will. So really it's a four bunker. When you bring that bunk down, though, it kind of blocks off the access to the uh, secondary bathroom. A couple windows back here, TV back here too, and then cupboard space across the top. Here is our secondary bath, porcelain toilet, dump truck fits, skinny cupboard there, sink, mirror. You know how I feel about mirrors, Will. Yeah, man. never seen one you didn't like. Nope. That's it. Okay, heading back through the living space now, Willie. Stay with me, bud. Up into the main bedroom bath. I do like the fact that we got this nice little closet in through there as you walk in the main door. We've got a door here into our bathroom. Another porcelain style toilet. Dump truck fits here too. I'm six feet tall, let's see if I fit in the shower. Yeah, lots of height in here for me, glass shower doors, undermount stainless steel sink, cupboard right there, medicine cabinet right there, and then look at this extra little bit of storage here for bathroom stuff. Nice little uh, uh, countertop with a receptacle, maybe plug in your hair straightener there, Will. Yep. Or sorry, your curler, you're more of a curling kind of guy. Into the bedroom here now. We got our king size bed out in the slide, nice headboard, smaller cupboards across the top, windows on both sides, bedroom TV goes up and through there, door side window with two large drawers here in our dresser. And then here at the front, we're gonna have laundry prep right there or storage, however you wanna use that. Sliding doors here for our front wardrobe that's gonna have hanging and shelving. And then two more drawers here down below. That's the video, folks. Hit the like button, the subscribe button. Hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Leave us a comment down below. Have yourself a good day.